Hi everyone, Rach here from Inky Planners. Welcome to another video. Um, I'm going to apologise in advance for my voice. Um, I'm recovering from something. Don't quite know what. Um, but I sometimes get a bit coffee. Um, so we'll see how we go. If I suddenly revert to overlaying music for my first ever chance or try, um, you'll know it's because um, my voice is just giving me too much grief and I really would like to get this video done. Uh, I have an order from Goulet Pens. I have already tried to do this video and the battery said no thank you. So um, I had actually gone ahead and opened everything um, and I got a new sticker which I put on my book and you can see where are we here? We've got some ink samples. Um, oops, I don't need that. I also got two um, new syringes, just as backups really, um, <clears throat> and I got, I should have looked, um, I don't know if I can find this easily, these are just, oh yes, it's a platinum preppy and it should be fine, yes. So I got a, a new platinum preppy because even though I didn't like the other one, I'm beginning to like it so I decided to go for fine whereas my other one is extra fine uh, and I got the converter for it what fell on the floor is the ink cartridge so I actually brought the converter this time um, so and it's got a pretty barrel we can see all right in this light so anyway so I've got that put that out of the way um, I don't need that <clears throat> so I've got ink cartridges um, and we will be swatching all except for two and if I find that bag I did find the bag it's this bag in here I did get is that one that's one of them they're both in here um, these two can we see is it going to, there we go Australian Roses, Noodler's Ink. Um, I actually got two more samples because I really did like this when I swatched it. Come on, focus please. Um, and because I haven't been able to find a, a full bottle of it anywhere, because it may not be available as a full bottle anymore, I don't know, um, I picked up a couple of samples while I could. So we don't need to swatch those because we've already swatched it. I don't directly know where everything's going to go. Um, these bags are not probably going to be in any order, so we're just going to do them um, as they come per bag. Uh, and I've got my little book, and I probably need to do a little bit of rearranging. Um, I'll keep that handy. So we'll just go, I'll try and keep colours together where I can, but that isn't always going to be um, an option. So we've got a green ink, we've got... Uh, a purple ink and a blue ink so we haven't got any <laughs> we'll just go for it all right it's been a while since I've done this and I don't really know what I'm doing <clears throat> okay so we will start with the green ink so this is uh, a sailor ink Manyo Yuki Kusa, Kusa I don't know focus on the ink bottle I don't think it is very um, I will show the pages close up at the end. Oh, look at that. Nice vibrant ink. So I'm going to do the trick with the end. Okay. Try not to get too much ink everywhere. So this is Sailor. We didn't get much ink at all. There is a drip. Get more on the barrel of the thing. <sighs> Let's put the lid on before we spill any ink. Go, judging by how I'm going all shaky. 
men jag That's a very nice dark green, I like that. Well, mid-green, I would say. Uh, let's see how we go. All right, blue probably is next, which is another sailor ink. Uh, Sha Shakiori. So, <laughs> I've got enough trouble. Oh, look, I've already got ink all over me. Oh, look, and I have hardly started. Sailor. There we go. That looks like it's a very wet ink. I've purposely left a page. Oh, come. No, not too bad actually. Wow. <laughs> Look at that. So this is another sailor. S H I K I. I like this blue. O R I S O U. Just proving I can spell. With this order, it means I can actually now start swatching the colours in their colour family too. Okay, this is Noodler's Purple Mountain Majesties. I can't actually remember how many inks there are to swatch, but we're going to have fun. You might need a drink. Wow, this that's quite a lot of ink laid down here okay so we have got Noodler's ink purple mountain majesties wow like this too I think I've only got two or four slots left in my ink sample holder, doodad. So <laughs> we're going to have to stop buying samples after this. Okay, let's move on to the next bag of four. <sighs> what have we got? That's a blue. That's a green. That's a green, and that's a, we'll do this one next. So this is Private Reserve Arabian Rose. A bit too much water on that one. Either that or it soaks into the paper really quickly. I don't think I've ever had a, pr a private reserve before. What's it called? Arabian Rose. Okay. The swatch isn't that great, but the writing in it is quite nice. So we've got two greens and a blue. We'll do the blue and then we'll do the two greens. I'm liking that top green so far. So this is Pelican Edelstein Appetite. I've seen a few people do this colour lately and I really wanted to try it. Ooh. 
I believe there's a pen to go with this, but it's a bit outside of my budget league, I would believe. Let's try not to lay too much ink down. Okay, so we have got Pelican, oh look at that, it's a bit more vibrant than I thought. Okay, that's gone into the a little bit okay oh stick my finger in the lid blimey so what's okay now we've got two greens so we'll do diamine magical forest now i can't remember oh yeah look i don't know if it's going to show up there's a bit of sheen in this i don't actually know if We'll have to look at the end and see. Oh, it's a, like a, a blue-green, I would call this. Lay down enough to see if there is any sheen. Oh, we didn't get anything on there. see the sheen already. Diamond magical forest. <laughs> um, I'll see if in the camera if I can see it sheening already. It's this bottom one you're looking at. I can see it, I'm not sure if it's coming across on the camera yet. Um, we'll have a look when I bring it up a little bit closer. And then we've got uh, Jacques Herbin, Herbin, Emerald of Chivor 1670. Oh, that's, that's actually... Looks like it's in the same colour family a little bit. Okay, I can feel there's a lot of water. That's nice. Right, we will just go J. Rachel, 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 did you see that? Look what I've done. We have spilled a drop. It didn't land on me, it only landed on that. Alright, does that, that looks like that's got some sheen in it too, some gold sheening. Glitter, whatever the correct term is. Okay, another bag of four. Can't even open a bag. Come on, Rachel. Right, that is a well, that's a lot. I don't even remember what that one is. Two diamonds. That's a purple. That's a magenta colour. And that's a green. So we'll do the green first. Look how interesting about the amounts of ink. Um, either unless. 
these ones are really full and then you look at that one and there's oh, it's not going to show I can't get it to show very well but you can see by the, the liquid floating around whereas you can't see it there I mean I'm not complaining at all quite happy to have plenty of ink um, alright we'll do the green first make sure the end is clear enough This is Diatramentus Jane Austen. Too. I'm so far I'm very happy with everything that I've got okay so that's a pinky color I do not know what this color is I think it's a purple and that's a purple so we'll go the pinky color first so this is Sailor Ink Studio 231 to move the book up. I will do that momentarily. We'll just finish this. Switch. Oh, put too much ink laid down. We'll just move those out of the way so we can move the book up. Apologise for my arm going across the screen. I hadn't really registered that fact. That's very pretty. Look at that. Okay. So this is Sailor. Studio 231. like that. Okay, All right, let's do these purples. So this is Diamine Tyrian Purple. Okay, so again the swatch isn't that outstanding but I quite like how it writes. Oh, getting all hot. Alright, so we've got Diamine Mon, Mon Bodo's hat. Right. <laughs> so it looks like I've got to get it to the video but then I knew that would happen oh look at that like a royally purple colour so there actually isn't that much ink in there it's just a very well I don't know what the term is for it oh look at that I 
I am liking that, so this is another timeline. There isn't that much. It is not a full bottle of, like I thought, so this is diamine. Mon. It's supposed to be an N, it doesn't matter. B O D D O S hat. Yeah. We're going on bleed through. <laughs> Alright, so just a reminder, if this is the first video of mine you're watching, this is a Loistrum. Um, it's not a Toma River paper book at all. Or any of the flash papers that everyone likes to use. But that's coming. I have got a swatch book. I just was waiting for this order to come so that then I could pick all the blues and all the greens and all the pinks, etc. Right, last bag, we've got four more vials which we're going to fit on this page. We'll try and put the next two. Then we've got a blue. Is that a blue? That's a blue. That's a purple. Another purple. Diamond purple. The green. And... Oh, uh, yeah. <coughs> uh, is it a ready pink? No, it's probably more red. Blood red. Alright, let's uh, get these last four done. Okay, so we've got a green. We'll put the green next to the green. This is Noodler's Army Green. A um, olivey green by the looks of it. So we'll come over here. Definitely an olive green. Noodlers. Oh, writing is not good now. I'm a bit too far away. But that's alright. This is just a log of what I get when I get it. I will put the right name in the book. Okay, what have we got here? We've got this. This doesn't match any colour that I've already got. This is Noodler's Rose in the Louvre. It's like a deep pink, really, on the red side of pink. Just put it under here. Oh, that's nice. That is nice. Okay. Oh. Noodlers, oh, Rose. That was very nearly a catastrophe. Did you see it wobble? Rose in the Louvre. How do we spell Louvre? There's supposed to be a V R E. That's actually very nice. I wonder what how that compares to the Australian roses. Can we find that? Swatch relatively quickly. Let's see. Invent. It's a bit deeper than the Australian roses. Very nice. Okay, what have we got? A deep magenta and then a green, I think. Two more and we're done. And hopefully you've enjoyed seeing all the inks come to life. Okay, uh, we might as well just carry on as we are. That's definitely a magenta. Diamine again. Ooh, this is nice. Oh, 
that is quite a nice deep color as well and then the last one we have got is a ferris wheel press and I can't remember if I got this because I was I saw someone swatch it uh, I can't remember this is ferris wheel press Edwards gardens and I think it's a sort of leaning to the turquoisey side And we'll just do Ferris wheel press as FWP. Edwards Gardens as Gardens. Cool. And what I might actually do, just to record this order, and then we can have a wee look at the Australian roses. Is we might just put this in as a record of the fact that we did get some more of this. Just right. So plus. that is our haul. Um, let's see if we can, I'm going to move the water out of the way, we can get through this video without having a catastrophe. What I'd like to do is hopefully you can see the two, these two here, the sheening on it. You can see the sort of silvery blobs in there and then it's, yeah, it's goldy in this emerald so I'll just there's a cord in the way just to show you up close very pleased very happy with that off the top of my head what do I favor I don't know um, I'm actually very happy with just about everything. This might be a little bit too dark blue, the Edwards Gardens for me. Um, but otherwise, I'm actually very happy with pretty much everything. Um, probably if I wasn't, if I wouldn't buy again, is probably the Arabian Rose. I don't know. It's not jumping out as a well. But yeah very happy all right everyone i shall leave you there which is your favorite let me know uh, and i will catch you hopefully in another video soon it just depends on how i'm going but we've got through this all right without any major coughing my guts up so we'll see how we go all right thanks everyone i'll catch you again soon bye for now